hello how are you welcome to another lecture which of the following structures does not pass behind the lateral malleolus uh, so from the question um, it is not clear that we have to find out the structure which passes behind the lateral malleolus then it will be easy for us to find out the structure which not pass behind the lateral malleolus so if we structure not pass behind the lateral malleolus here the options options are peroneus brevis tendon sural nerve short saphenous vein peroneus longus tendon and tibialis anterior tendon so we have to find out one of the structure which don't pass behind the lateral malleolus so here we can see this is the lateral malleolus in this picture this is the lateral malleolus here this is the lateral malleolus and behind the lateral malleolus we can see four structure passes there are two tendons one nerve and one vein so in the second picture first of all we can see the two tendon one is the peroneus longus tendon another one is peroneus brevis here we can see this is the peroneus longus tendon here and then peroneus brevis so peroneus longus and peroneus brevis these two important muscle it passes behind the lateral malleolus in the first picture we can see two other structure passes behind the lateral malleolus one is the nerve and this nerve is the sural nerve and another one is the laser saphenous vein or a small saphenous vein so Two tendon one is the peroneus longus another one is the peroneus brevis and two other structure one nerve on three nerve is the sural nerve and vein is the laser saphenous vein or short saphenous vein so here these two structure you can see it is listed both s one s is sural another s for a small saphenous vein or short saphenous vein on the other hand here we can see this is the p p one is the peroneus longus another one is the peroneus brevis so double s double p it is the shortcut to remember the muscle limb and other structure which passes behind the lateral malleolus so here our final answer here we can see the tibialis anterior tendon tibialis anterior tendon don't passes behind the lateral malleolus actually tibialis anterior it passes to this area that means the extensor aspect of the foot or dorsum of the foot and the tibialis anterior it lies in the anterior surface so the tibialis anterior it don't pass behind the lateral malleolus and other such there's two s two p here you can see one s another ends p p the 2p peroneus longus peroneus brevis and 2s short saphenous vein or small saphenous vein and sural nerve so here it is not nerve it is actually vein so short saphenous vein and sural nerve 